the DNA molecule itself resembles a sort of twisted ladder. The steps of the DNA ladder consist of four different molecules, adenine, thymine, cytosine, and guanine, A, T, C, G. Step by step, these letters spell out the formulas for every living organism. The formula for a human being, the human genome, contains over three billion letters. At the level of our genes, we are, all of us, are nearly identical. But even though the differences in our genes are slight, modern genetic sequencing technology can detect these differences. So the uniqueness of our genetic code can be used as a tool in a variety of applications, from paternity determinations to criminal forensics. Forensic scientists can recover and extract DNA from the smallest of tissue samples. And once a sample has been obtained, a multi-step process called DNA electrophoresis is performed that makes visible the tiny differences in a genetic sequence. First, enzymes are used to cut the DNA strands at specific locations. This results in DNA fragments of different sizes for different people. These DNA pieces are placed in a special gel, and an electric current is applied. The different sized pieces of DNA move through the gel at different speeds. And this results in a distribution of DNA in the gel that can identify the DNA owner. The final pattern represents a sort of DNA fingerprint that is unique to each individual.